pure torsion. Pure torsion case is this when a member is in pure torsion, when its cross section are subjected to only trans torsional movements. If the cross section jo hai, yani cross sectional area hai, is per slip kya lag raha hai? Torsional moment ki wajah se jo bhi is mein uh, rotation produce ho raha hai, that is only because of the torque and no other force is acting on it. Thik hai, koi axial force is mein act nahi kar rahi hai and not accompanied by any axial forces or bending moment. Only because of the torque or the torsional moment, um, this is subjected to the rotation. So, us case ko kehte pure torsion ki case. A member is said to be in pure torsion when its cross sections are subjected to only torsional moments or a torque and not accompanied by the axial forces and bending moment. So, this is the uh, basically solid circular shaft. So, it is under the pure tor uh, torsion and the internal forces to develop for the counter counteract the torque. Okay, internal forces are developing because of the applied twisting moment. Ki se, only purely usi ki se ye internal forces develop. Nahi. So at an element, the force DF developed is in the direction normal to the radial direction. Okay, and the force is obviously shearing force and thus the element are in pure shear. So in DF, jo hai, DF1, DF2, DF3, these uh, forces basically resisting forces which is twisting moment ko resist kar rahi, koshish kar rahi, which is developing on the cross-sectional area uh, of the uh, cross-sectional surface area of the shaft. Or this is because of the pure shear uh, which is happening. The force is obviously shearing force and thus the elements are in pure shear. And DA is the area of the element at a distance R from the axis of the shaft. So, in case, if DA is uh, small area, area of the element at a distance R from the axis of the shaft, then DF force will be small force for particular small area will be tau shearing distress into DA. That area will be the force. And the torque for that particular um, area will be D, uh, df into r torque will be df force into radial distance and where tau is the shearing stress so this was we can define kar sakte kisi bhi shaft par jo force lag rahi uh, force develop ho rahi due to the torsional moment and what is the amount of torque applied can be calculated by knowing the force and multiplying with the uh, distance r from the axis of the shaft 